there's only one place it's gonna lead to, right? That's heaven. Woo. I'm naked. And afraid. They were looking at me? Yeah, you guys wanted to see something? Here, I'll give you guys a show. Hey everybody! And welcome back to C Delta T Plays Inside. I am inside currently. I am in my room. And I'm playing the game inside. I'm playing inside inside. Isn't that crazy? Isn't that isn't that a crazy uh, coincidence? The last time we went through a bunch of puzzles, I had to, I had to I had to what's what's a good way to say this? I had to not spoil. Oop. I had to basically ch not cheat. Oh no, not yet. I basically had to look up how to do one an area. Okay, this is like the perfect time to do this. No, nope, not okay. When is the perfect time to do this? I have one. I don't have enough time to do this. I do it over when this thing is on the other side. It's the perfect time to do it. Go down. Okay. Ah! Like right here, safe. Right here, safe. Right here. Right, right, right here. No, I'm not gonna risk it. All right, this is a good time now. All right, this should be like really close to where I am at. Oh my goodness, that was really close. Right, I'm gonna be like right here, hopefully. Oh, okay. Okay, just run it. Oh my god. I can make it. No, I cannot make it. Am I just dead now? Man, who would thought light light would be so scary? I have to go all the way. I have to push it all the way. And I probably have to climb that thing to get back over here. No, wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. No, stop. Ah, you punk. Alright, just be patient. Patient. And go. There you go. Alright, just run, just run, just run, just run. I should be able to jump that, right? That seems like a possible jump. I could probably do a bit more, but I'm not, I don't wanna risk it. Yeah, that's perfect. That was just enough, I think. Alright, so we're good. We, we, this isn't too bad so far. See. Well, obviously you have to go into the hole. So, Geronimo! Woohoo! Waha! Hey, fish friends. How's it going? And this is why I don't eat fish. Because fish are friends, not food. No, it's actually because I just don't like the idea of fish. It's kind of gross. There's nothing in here. There was just fish in here. This is a very good tank to have, I guess. Very useful, I see. You. No, you know, you. thanks. Yeah, thank you. I, I am me. Got some containment pods, or what they look like to be containment pods. Isn't this how they brought the people around? I believe. What does this do? Am I underwater? Or is the water above me? I think water is above me. Okay, uh, hopefully that was intentional. Okay, I don't know what that does. Let's go see over here to the left. Hopefully the answer is... And it's not the answer, but something. Open this though. See if I can open this. I can open this. I said it before, I'll say it. Oh, okay. Oh, the water's gonna be going in now. No, it's... That's not how physics works. That's not how physics works. If anything, the water should be like right here. So, I think it's Bernoulli's principle or something, but the way that the water works is, uh... It wants to be at the same level on both sides. So if you have like a... Two bottles connected through it with a straw somewhere. They're going to want to be lev leveled out. Because... I don't exactly know why. But basically... Oh yeah. Actually, I know why. Because there's like the pressure exerted from the air. 
would push downward to make them even and so that they would the pressures on both sides would be equal. That's at least that's how I think of it. I'm not sure if that is 100% accurate. It's been a while since I last took a well, physics class, but that is what I do remember. I took a bit of physics, yeah. I think I took up to um electromagnetic physics. I'm not sure if that's what it's called, but There is water up above, isn't there? Does this, this will probably kill me, right? Yeah. Alright, so I'm gonna push the button down here. I don't know what this button does, but I'm gonna push it anyways. You know what? Actually, I'm gonna go see what's on the right side. I haven't been to the right side yet. So I'm guessing this is one of the, like, the major puzzles in the game. Because there was like the major- the first major puzzle I remember was the uh... What was it? It was the- the man one. So what does this do? Oh. Oh, I see. I had to knock it off. Then I can carry it around. So wait for it to go up. Knock it out. <laughs> that was some force. That was a lot of force. I think I know how to do this now. I have to grab it while it's midair, don't I? Oh, okay. It's like a rocket ship. Rocket man burning up the air up here alone. Let's go. It would be really funny if it's me in the head. Do it. Oh, come on. I wanted to hear a dunk. Dunk. Okay, and then you do this. You push the button to make it go up there. Nice. Now, all right, we did it. I have to go all the way back around. And then I'll be, you know, be very disappointed in the fact that this puzzle platform, based on physics and such, has incorrect physics with their uh, uh, with this containment unit. All right. Let's see. I don't know exactly what to do yet, but I know I'm getting there. It's multiple parts. It's, it's, a, it's a process, you know? It's a process we have to solve and figure out. So obviously, I probably have to go all the way up. So, we put this one. We push this one underneath. Probably. I mean, I could probably put this on the top, but I feel like this would be better at the bottom. Oh. No, I have, to, I have to do it the other way. I have to do it this way, don't I? That's, that's, that's poorly timed. I have to be faster, I think. I think I have to... This one first. Then this one. Jump it. Oh, that was a bad decision. Do it the other way. Yeah, I do it the other way. So the bottom one goes first. Woo! Rocket ship. Why is how is water in the air? Oh, am, am I upside down? I can't be upside down though, can I? No, I can't. Is there like there must be some ridiculous amount of surface surface tension? Am I right? Haha, <laughs> physics. I don't know. Alright, so there's like a button over here. Let's go press it and see what the door does. It looks like a door button thing. Yeah, it's a door button. That's uh... That's probably a nuclear reactor of some kind and it's gonna be a giant explosion. Let's see. Ah, uh, what, what? All I know is I don't trust glowing things. I died. I, <laughs> I died. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, interesting. So I'm gonna try to... F so I can't go down. I'll die if I do. Oh, this thing is gonna open this hatch right here. Okay. I'm assuming that's what's gonna happen. 
I mean, it may be red and glowing, but you know, there's nothing dangerous about red and glowing, is there? Guess let's see what's in here. Go inside. Oh, the music stopped. Interesting. Suspenseful. Alright, let's go. Got some very bland hallways here. But this, you know, this game is very gray. Very, very gray. More colorful than, uh, what's it called? Limbo, but still very, very gray. Let's see what's on the left here. Alright, so I'm, I'm gonna guess we're gonna have to control these people at one point. Probably gonna be another weight problem. Can I grab this? I can, so we're probably gonna need this. Let's push it all the way across. I mean, if there's something that you can act, if there's something that you can interact with, let's say I guess it's safe to assume that you're gonna need it at some point. Okay. Is that a kid with a man with a hat? But I thought the kids were always captured. Oh no. Okay, good. Alright. Ignore the moving box, it's magic. Oh, that noise scared me. Alright, let's go across. Hopefully we don't see those guys again. Those jokers! You know, trying to do their job and such. Alright, that seemed like pointless. Oh, there's a camera and guys over there. It's really quiet though. Okay, so I control water now. Okay. I, I know how to do it. I know how to do it now. Pretty sure I solved the issue. You know, I think you want this to hold the water. And by hold the water, I mean hold the door. Hold the door. I don't want to say anything about that, but... You know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Alright, let's keep... Let's keep solving this puzzle. Alright, so... At what level does the water have to be? Okay, so I feel like... This is very quiet. It's really disturbing me. I'm sorry. Can I jump into the water like this? No, it needs to be lower. Right, that looks. That should be fine, I think. Alright, perfect. Hold on. That can't be right. Can it? That can't be right. Hmm. I need to get across. Alright, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me think about this. So, I obviously have to go across. I need... That, 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 uh, platform, that box for something. What can I use the box for? I can use the box to get into the... I know how to do it now. I 100% know how to do it now. I want the box to be on this side, not on that side. And that way I can, the water can be high enough, the door is open. And I'm high enough to get the, uh, what's it called? Get the get to the water. All right, that's 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 the solution. I'm pretty. I'm on, I'm 99% sure. Don't call it a fluke. All right, so let's go all the way down. You know what? I'm probably just dead. This is just in the part of my imagine, imagination right now. Well, there you go. Bring the thing down. Bring it low enough so that the door is open. 
That seems about the sweet spot. Now I should be able to get across, swim across, and be safe. What? Don't call. I don't know. Don't call it a fluke. I don't know. Is that what I said? I don't know. I don't know anymore, man. All right, let's do this. Like, okay, the the, the quietness is really deafening. Are these like explosives? They're probably explosives, right? Is that little girl back to kill me? Well, it doesn't kill me, it just makes me stronger. Remember that girl. Alright, so I definitely have to go underwater. There's something. This this definitely adds more verticality to, verticality to the game. Okay, there's a... Uh... Am I back where I started? No, it's just... The place looks very similar. What? How was I supposed to know? Alright, so... So basically just time it right. How do these guys not see up? Well, obviously you have to go this way, right? They did not see me, thankfully. Now I have to be careful about these guys. Alright, just run for it. There's a button. I need water to press that button. The uh, button's in the other room, is it not? Oh my god, the button's gonna be in the other room. Great. 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 Some cheese, why don't you? Alright. This kid jumps upstairs really weird. <laughs> He's doing like the, the Captain Falcon knee. But I can't hide anymore. Oh, they're not. They're just not there anymore. Okay, what did I do? Are the bodies just gonna fall? The bodies are just gonna fall. Yep. Oh, they're alive. Oh, they're moving. Wait a minute. But they're, they're not attached. They're not attached. Are they trying to kill me? Okay, they're just following me. Okay. I was worried for a second. Woo. How am I... Uh, did the, uh, like, big blast combine my brainwaves with the, uh, with the people there? Or something? Because I remember in the start of the last episode, they, uh... Hold on. Alright, I know how to do this. But at the beginning of the last episode, there was a giant pulsing wave that broke my helmet. But I'm gonna assume that the helmet broke, but somehow got attached to my head? Somehow? I don't know. So I'm obviously gonna have to go back, press the button, bring the water back down. Those are just moving limbs. That is, uh... I mean, these people don't even look like people anymore. They look like... Are they like cloning humans or something like that? So I need you guys to toss me up here. Alright, nice jump. That was like a wall jump right there. They're like taped up and like this person's head is like... a neck and like, ooh, these guys are just creepy. But I mean, it's good to know that I have fish and uh... headless people to help me. They're not headless, but you know. That's enough. Alright, swim across here guys. Well, it's good to know that my brainwaves can go through uh... Water, a different medium. More physics, isn't this? This is just a good. This is you know puzzle platformer, physics based. You know all of this good physics jokes. I don't really have, but nice. Come on, guys. They don't see me. Am I controlling them? But they're workers. Huh. I thought they were workers. I thought they were gonna be like bad guys or something. Fight me now. Come on. I dare you guys. All you guys that were trying to get me, let's see what you let's see what you got. Can you toss me across? That was <laughs> thunk 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 thunk. Well, ignore what I just said, please don't fight me anymore. Well I have to go down there then. Oh, there's a person there. Is that what they wanted to see, that person? Well, I saw the person. But I don't know what the person was doing. I barely saw it. Catch me! Thank you, guys. 
Oh, okay, okay, well... I had fun with you guys. You guys are spines and... Legs are weird and stuff, but, you know... You guys are alright. The hard hats know what they're doing. They're being safe. OSHA standard regulations, baby. Alright, so it looks like I have to go to the left first. Oh, is this the elevator? Hold on. They're up there. Can I just get them to fall off? No. Do I have to go all the way across? Can they fall off from the top is what I'm wondering right now. Probably. You know, I don't know how I feel about the backtracking puzzles. I'm not sure if I'm a big fan of them. I have to go back and forth a lot. And it adds some complexity to it, but also adds a lot more legwork. You know, more walking and running, which I'm not sure how I feel about. Maybe this is just more for the mentally sophisticated. And I'm not mentally sophisticated enough. I don't know. I didn't mean to do that. Okay. They almost tossed me. Oh yeah, yeah they can help, probably help me open the store. That's probably what they needed them for. Well, thanks a lot, lady in the back with no hands. Thanks for helping me. <laughs> thanks for helping us uh, open that door. Okay, the guy's running. There's guys running. Is that guy wearing socks or are those tapes? He has like a black tape on his ankle. He's the only one with black on him. Creepy, eerie music. Let's jump up. Toss me. Toss me up. How about that? Bad, bad, bad meme. Bad joke. I apologize. Honestly, not a big fan of that. It's, I think it's really dumb. I just, I'm not a fan of it. And I, what's more disappointing is that she got popular because of that. You know, it's like, why? Because the person said some words. I don't know. Pull this upward. I thought I heard beeping. There's people just running. Are they scared of me or something? Have I become the thing that they fear most? Oh, that person has been... We're in, we're in Westworld now, boys. This is, this is Westworld, isn't it? This is Westworld! Oh god. Oh. It's a combination of Westworld and Get Out? <laughs> oh, they're all running to see something. What are they trying to see? I want to see too. Can I see? Hello? Okay, so I can't do anything. Oh, I want to see. Obviously, something very exciting is going on. I mean, these people who wanted to kill me earlier are ignoring me. I'm curious as to what would want them to stop killing me. Can I jump across? Um. What am I supposed to do with this ladder here? I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. Can I climb this? Yes, I can. Okay. Alright, so this doesn't take a genius. Swing. That lighting effect is really good. <laughs> I broke the lamp. I'm sorry. Uh, hopefully insurance covers it. Hopefully your insurance- Hopefully uh, children being annoyances is covered underneath your insurance plan. We got over here. They're all, I want to see what they're looking at. Is that too much to ask for? I don't appreciate being left out. You know. Let's see. Now we're underneath. We're Gordon Freeman now, boys. That was weird. Uh, I don't know what happened there. Oh, <laughs> yeah. I don't know if that's ever happened to anyone in real life, where they like try to open a hatch, but they don't realize that they, in order to open the hatch, they have to get off the hatch. Let's do it.
Dunk. This is a really cool machine. Oh, this ladder there. Should be easy to jump. Ah, uh, I made the mistake. I just want to slide down the ladder. Is that too much to ask for? I can make that jump. I'm a please. Thank you. Like, wouldn't it just be so much faster if I could just climb down? There you go. I think I can survive that fall, right? Yeah, good. Luckily, there's no three dimensions in this game, so that otherwise I would have uh, fallen off by now. Is this what they were looking at? Just water. Oh, turbine. Sure, let's open up this thing that says uh, caution danger. I mean, what kind of danger would it be? You know, there's only there's only like a caution thing right there. Not like that sounds any dangerous at all. Like, why is the kid doing this? Okay, just stay away from it for now. I just supposed to go in there. Let's go in there then. Oh, I have to go down. There's another one there I have to pull down. Can I make it? I'm going. I'm get, am I getting? Am I moving? Here. I have an idea. I think I may need like something to help me. Go as far down as I can. I need something to stop this. Uh, There's probably going to be like a... A button or something to stop the whirlpool from going. Let's just check over here. I can't. Oh, there's a, there's a switch. You got this. Alright, turned off. Let's go see what's inside. I, I keep trying, I'm trying to go down. Someone call me? Or was that just a splash? I thought I heard that someone say something. Maybe I'm going crazy. So let's see what's in ha huh, In here. Alright, so I have to be fast about this. There's obviously going to be a, some time for the fan to start up. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ah! ah! I didn't let go too soon. Great. Off. Oh my. Let me wait for it to power down completely. I think it powered down completely. Jump and go. Alright, let's do it again. Alright, we got it. Let it. Open up for a bit. And let's go. There's only one place this can lead to, right? That's heaven. Woo! I'm naked. And afraid. They were looking at me? Yeah, you guys wanted to see something? Here, I'll give you guys a show. <laughs> yeah, here. That's probably not a good thing to do. I can't. I'm not a. This is not a zoo, damn it. What the heck is... Holy... What is that? It has arms and legs. Mom, is that you? What is this? It's so jelly. Like, oh my god, it moves so weird. It's grabbing me. Oh, that's... A... <laughs> I mean, I would shake your hand too, but I don't know which hand to shake. I'm inside of it. I'm... I'm a giant jelly bean made of human flesh. Wow. <laughs> can I grab this thing now? I can. Alright, well, uh, I have legs too, I can walk. 
Well, that took an interesting turn. Uh, I'm gonna stop here for now. We're gonna see what this giant jelly muscle man thing can do. I hope you guys enjoyed this. And I'll jiggle you next time. <laughs> Deuces.